All right, so Rafa Nadal has just got into the fourth round against Sanego and in straight sets. But there was some conversation had at the net during the match and at the end of the match. And this is what Rafa had to say after his, uh, after his match in the post-match interview about the comments that he made or the comments that he said to Sanego. This is what Rafa had to say when the interviewer asked about the spiciness of the match. Rafa said, sorry, not spicy at all. I feel very sorry now if I have bothered him. I just wanted to tell him something. I did it in a nice way, but I feel really bad now I have bothered him. I'm going to talk to him right now. So that was straight after the match. Rafa saying, I'm sorry to, uh, to have that confrontation with Sinego. And it was a weird thing for Rafa because what happened uh, and what we think happened according to multiple sources is that Sinego was making very loud grunting noises. That's what Ra uh, Rafa was not happy with. Uh, also, there was some other antics with Sinego wanting the roof shut really early before the sun was down and Rafa was like, really? I don't know if that's a thing. And they went off court and it was a whole thing. But then the, uh, the, the excessive shouting and grunting from Sinego, Rafa didn't like that. So he called Sinego to the net at four games all in that, set, in that third set and said, hey, what's the deal? And that's sort of where this whole thing is blown up. And Rafa's saying it's nothing. And he says, you know, he apologizes. But let me know in the chat, in the comments below, what do you reckon? Do you reckon Rafa was in the right to kind of pull Sinego up on his antics? Or do you think Rafa should have left it because he was already winning the match anyway? But it's weird to see Rafa in any kind of controversy. And I think this is a little bit of a stretch of a controversy. But again, that's what happened. Let me know if you agree with Rafa or disagree.